after last week's show, um, good good friend of the show in the sense that uh, he's a teammate of mine, Connor Silky Gavin. Yep. Made an observation to me. He messaged me about you. Uh, not just the podcast. He messaged me about your channel. Oh. And he had a question that I think a lot of your fans would be dying to know the answer to. <laughs> oh, God. Why is it that you, 50,000 plus subs, uh, superstar, can't go, can't go outside without photos being taken, legitimate <laughs> celebrity status in this state, football icon. Why? <laughs> That's wh- a massive rap. <laughs> why is it that you're kicking around a Faulkner in your YouTube videos? You're kicking, you're not kicking around... A, I'm kicking around a lie bird. Oh, that's what the term is. It is a Sharon. For. It is you're, a Sharon. You're kicking around a lie bird. You're not. Why? What's wrong with the game day match for you? I'm sure Sharon would be more well, than willing. Sharon, if you're listening, I, I wouldn't. Well, I do have my, my fork now. One touch, which is which is handy. Okay, I, yeah. I would never touch. What's the WA footy? I didn't even know there was a WA There's one. A, a Burley. I'm oh, not, the Burley. I'm not going yeah. anywhere no, near a that Burley. That is pointy. Hurts a foot, and they'll be going there, you Victorian cowards. But no. that is just. I'm steering well clear of Burley. So I, I think the liar bird is a Sharon. I'm not actually sure what it is, but as well, the answer is. I've got uh, it's a worse quality leather. So, oh, right. so this is coming from a man who spent five <laughs> years working at the AFL store. This is a man who knows his football. Yep. Um, I don't kick them very often on weekends, but I know a lot about them. Uh, a liar bird is isn't kangaroo leather. Yeah. The Sharon does it get any more Australian? The Sharon game day ball is kangaroo leather, and that's what you need to be kicking around, mate. So <laughs> I'm going to start a GoFundMe page after this. <laughs> Clearly, YouTube isn't paying the bills quite as it would like to be, and we'll get the fans to donate for a Caden McDonald match ball. So finally, you can so the the ball can match the prestige of which you you have undertaken. Yeah, beautiful. Well, I'm keen. Well, the, yeah, the answer is um, myself and Cookson played footy tennis with my good Sharon. Uh, oh, so, so you did have one. The mystery. This is the answer I was looking for. Well, I did have one, but it became waterlogged and shocking. So I used that one in footy tennis, and it now has no logos, and it's just scuffed. Okay, but that's I reckon that's the best footies to kick the old ones that. Oh, it, it's like so plenty scuffed. of grip. No, no. Oh, so the opposite. So they like, come around. Yeah, full it's circle. dry and slippery, and bald. Um, <laughs> yeah, and mid bowls Liebird was just in the back of my car after we kicked the footy the other right. way. So okay. we used that. But well, yeah, a, a good Sharon. Uh, it's on me on me Chrissy list. <laughs> yeah, I'll be sure. I'll be sure to get. We've never got each other a Christmas present. I don't think. No. Nah. This might be the year. No. Nah. Sharon game day match balls one hundred and sixty dollars. So completely unrelated. I reckon that's what we set the cap at. <laughs> <laughs>